Hello Fiber Friends! I hope you've had a really good last couple of weeks. I didn't post anything last week because I didn't do a weekly video last week because I didn't get anything done other than spinning. I did work a little bit on a sweater and that sweater is now done. I used uh, Premier Cotton Sprout Speckles. Primary is the colorway. I'm love I'm I might have to make another one of these because I like it so much. Here we go. Beautiful colors. Look at the a lot of lace work. Nice long sleeves. Um <laughs> turned out so very cute. Cotton sprouts, I I like the yarn a lot. Out of five balls, I have this much loft. Maybe be able to get a dish dish towel or washcloth out of it. We'll try. Um, nice cotton. This is going to be such a lovely sweater. Um, it's, it's a gift. It's a gift. I used 13.92 uh, ounces and 900.21 yards in the making of the sweater. Took me a while because I've also been um, doing true to fleece, which kind of goes right along with Tour de France bicycle ride. While the cyclists are pedaling, we're treadling our wheels. <laughs> Maha Craft Susie, she she got a good workout this last uh, 22 days. And I did blow my knee out at one point and started using my uh, little electric e-wheel. This is the Nano 1.1. And yes, I know my bobbins don't match. I do that on purpose. I don't know why I do it on purpose. I don't, <laughs> I don't know. The end cap should be purple just the same as the center piece, but because there's three colors, I mishmashed them all. That's just, this is how I roll, I guess. I don't know, I can't explain it. Um, there is an upgrade for the motor on that and I have not upgraded it yet because I figured I'm gonna wait for this motor to poop out why fix what's not broken right so we're gonna leave it and then I used a uh, yarn B scrubology cotton yarn and I also made a dish scrubby I like this one it reminds me so much of Michigan and the beaches and the beautiful sunsets there on the west coast of of Lake Michigan so pretty there um, this also will be a gift I used the scrubology 1.32 ounces so this has a total of three ounces in the in the ball so I am using the other half the ball to make a second one maybe a little bit bigger We'll see uh, how it comes out. So 54.99 yards in the making of, of this uh, <clears throat> washcloth. So that will also be a gift coming up. Um, that's all of my makes for this week. I need to keep this label because I am doing a second one that's not done yet. Ha ha, because I finished the sweater. So happy. Finishing the sweater was definitely a feat, especially when I am spending 8 to 10 hours a day, sometimes 12 hours a day, trying to get all the spinning done because my original goal was to spin 3 pounds, which I was just shy of 3 pounds last year when I only spun on my 4-hour stream Monday through, fr Monday through Friday. Um, and I did a couple hours both Saturday and Sunday. I didn't spend the whole weekend trying to spin things up, but this year was a little different. I did spin on Saturday and Sunday. Um, two Sundays out of three, I did do spinning the first weekend when Tritifly started. It started on a Saturday, June 29th. I did not um, stream any of that, but I did stream the past couple of Sundays, which I don't normally do. Sundays is family day, rest day, all of that stuff. Um, but I think Mondays Mondays were rest days for Tour de Fleece. And I did not rest on those Mondays. I rest the, the last day, um, which was yesterday. So if you want to see, I will upload all the videos and everything. Um, if you don't want to see all the making of it, 
on Sunday, yesterday's stream, I did at the very beginning of stream show all of the yarns and everything I we blended together. We used the drum carter the week before true to fleece and carted up a bunch, uh, blended together and carted up a bunch of, of different fibers and that's mostly what I, what I spun. I think there's one bat, two bats. There's two bats that I did not spin that we carted, um, but I did spin other material as well. So anyway, other fiber. So anyway, <laughs> let me give you all my totals and everything for this week, and I will be sure to get Sunday's video up, so if you don't watch all of the making, you can at least see all of the finished yarns I did, because I made uh, 4.03 pounds, so I met my goal, that's why I kind of took yesterday off, uh, but I still streamed. We started making an uh, emotional support chicken as well. And then, uh, yeah, all the, all the good things. Let's see, yardage. Yardage-wise, I made 4,192 yards. Most of it is uh, either three-ply, chain-ply. There is, I think, two... One or two that are four ply. I think there's one, only one that is four ply, and that was the gray. I think everything else was three ply or chain ply. Anyway, <laughs> the totals of everything I made for this week I did 15.24 ounces and 955.2 yards. And then uh, totals for the year 324.2. 39 ounces for the year taking me to 20.2 pounds and let's see yardage wise for the year I have 24,901.99 uh, yards for the year taking me to 14.1 miles uh, <laughs> completed for this year so lots done I hope y'all have enjoyed seeing and hearing about all of the makes but is what it is you know you know i can throw these labels out i used um five balls for the sweater if i were to make myself one i would probably make it um sleeveless i would probably just go sleeveless <laughs> that's the way i roll i don't like to wear sleeves in the summer i probably should though because you know skin cancer and the sun does bad things but you know you know there's always sunscreen <laughs> anyway y'all have a fantastic week we got more makes coming up i hope to see you in the next video have a great week we'll see ya bye